um well hello I'm young K OG here um today I'm just doing a video on how to this is a second more or less it's more of a first option but it's a second option if the first way doesn't work for you but this is more of a first option as most likely you can only do it first because once you've modded it with brute force you change the decimal and moving the decimal makes it different from how to mod it within the save editor so I'm gonna put something up on my video for the people who are new on the video to try this out first and if this doesn't work for them go over to the other video and try that out um, alright so today I just made a save um, for the completed version of the game as you could say, um, the, within the folder there is um, UK and US. You can just um, copy over to your PS3, save data, and then bam. Oh, and I recommend you back it up. Um, yeah, just in case any malfunctions, or I'm not saying malfunctions, but just in case something gets corrupted you just want to make sure you have your files to use um, within it there's a readme so oh um, this doesn't come with licenses but you will be able to do the license again um, if you do the coronation cup trophy to get the coronation cup trophy it also gives you all the license and everything um, it also comes with a couple trophies um, you get level 60 on load up so once you start the game you should be level 60 um, these gives you a couple of instructions for how to get certain trophies like easy money drive past another car and that meter will pop up you pass the car or whatever and you buy another house you get this trophy blah 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 you get it I was gonna click close and close um this you cannot use with the save editor because it will just give you some error because the values have changed you already get a hundred nine million with it and I doubt you're gonna spend any money with the cars already in the garage you have most of the cars um, the DLC cars don't work unless you have DLC add-ons already otherwise the DLC cars will be turned into Mustangs um, I recommend you just sell them because it would be pointless to keep five Mustangs or depending on how many DLC cars are within the game already um, so I just copied over my player save to my computer just to show you how this works so the files will be in the description as always all the programs I use so first off you just want to click mod tools you just want to click red ITD2 blah 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 just click run now this pops up it would also open up a lot of files within the program um, so first off you just want to click file open folder and now bless or oh, 884 player save so you just want to open your player save and now it will say all files have been decrypted and loaded successfully meaning no errors when opening it um, as you can see it gives you your account information here 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 um, uh, as you can see you can back up your data back up your SFO so your param your ID um, yeah um, so what to do is to uh, over the tabs you just want to click game save editing and now you just want to choose whatever you want so for money you can obviously see from the last video I done 138 million three hundred and eleven thousand seven hundred and seventeen you can also choose how many casino chips you want blah 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 
you can choose your competition points your collection points your social points um, how much of the area you've discovered in area one how much in you discovered in area two blah 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 that's how easy it is and once you're done all you do is click file and then save all so I'm just gonna just maybe do like 200 just click file and then save all it says all files have been saved successfully make sure you always see these little thing comes up saying everything saved properly because you don't want anything going on your thing saying oh if something's been messed up just click ok and now you can just click close and then put this back onto your ps3 save data and then the file within the usb copy over and hopefully it will work if that doesn't work obviously as i said in the start of the video try the second way but the second way only changes your money so please rate comment and subscribe